Graduating college used to be the stepping stone into one's independent adulthood, but in recent years it has become the last event before migrating back home to mom and dad. Matt Carpinella, a full-time engineer at Birdtech LLC, has made the decision to move back home to Hamden, Connecticut. He plans on staying with his parents until he's financially stable. Yeah, I'm probably going to see how I feel about this job after a year and see whether I want to stay with it. And then if I do want to stay with it, I'll probably we'll take the money I have saved up and try and get an apartment closer to the job. Matt says there are plenty of positives with living at home. It's nice because now I don't have to pay for rent and everything. and I don't have to, like, I, it's less bills I have to worry about and stuff like that. But with that comes the burden of household chores. He needs to do his laundry. He's a disaster. <laughs> Laundry's fine. Dishes and laundry would be I nice. Need the, these living arrangements have become more common since the Great Recession that began in 2007. Researchers have found that 43% of people between the ages of 20 and 24 were still living with their parents. Last year, a reported 85% of college seniors said they planned on moving back home until they found a steady job. Students like Lorenzo Fortunato, who already have jobs lined up, are still making the decision to live home until they can pay off their student loans. You know, I, I, I kind of do have that only option because I really, I probably won't end up living in the city because it's just so much money and like, even though if I make good money, it still doesn't matter because it's so much, the cost of living is so high. And uh, I just have a lot of, you know, I, even I have loans to pay off, like a lot of loans. So, I mean, it has that crippling effect on every individual after they graduate because of, um, you know, they have to worry about, can I pay this off? Some may call it a failure to launch, but college administrators and even parents agree that students moving back home is one of the smartest moves they can make. Yeah, um, it, the cost is just high, and if students can kind of move home, make a salary, not have any kind of cost, quote unquote, cost of living, pay off loans. There's, there's certain things that a student can work on if they live at home. And plus, you know, who doesn't want to have someone cook meals for them? I know, that was great. This generation of young adults are now being called the boomerangers. And although their economic futures may be unclear, their return home after college is definitely a trend on the rise. Kate Sherry, QNN.